Hi friends, today you are going to do a solo work exercise of plate washer sketch. By doing this solo work exercise, you will learn to use the line sketch, half sketch, circle sketch, rectangle sketch, smart dimension and trim entities tools. Here you can see the drawing of plate washer with dimensions. So how to note down the, all the dimensions and a rough sketch of plate washer to do this tutorial. Let's begin it. Here you can see the sketch that you want to make. It's a plate washer sketch with dimensions. So first you have to go to the new and part a plate wall. Here is the graphic interface. Already selected. First you have to select the default plane. Here I am selecting the top plane and normalize it. Then you have to create this sketch. So for that I am selecting a center rectangle tool. And uh, so a rectangle here. Here. Then how to apply dimensions like uh, what first before that I'm going to draw a arc here is the center I'm using a center arc okay it shows dimension 53 that I want to change it to the 17 R 17 is the radius of the arc so I changed it to the 70 and also how to make sure its uh, total length of this rectangle is 40 yeah now it's completely turned to black that means it's fully defined so one do one thing I have to make this line as construction. Now, then I have to make a sketch of circle sketch of 15 mm diameter. And also I can how to do 15 mm. Yeah, this much part is okay. Now I have to create this part. For that I need a center line. Here, this is I am snapping the midpoint of this line and extend towards the origin. And I have to apply a smart dimension that means it's 10 mm inside. Now, I have to create a line. Here, I am using a midpoint line. It, it's um, it extends towards the both ends. I mean to apply dimension also as the 15, so 15 mm dimension. I have to create another arc using the center arc sketch tool. So it's the yellow. Uh, color shows the item have conflicts that means it's over defined here we can see over defined so that it, normally it comes when uh, we uh, define a dimension defaultly that it's obviously it will come so don't worry about it just click on this dimension and delete it now it's okay it turn to blue okay here made two lines to join it again draw a line to join it okay click on this line and convert it for construction line okay now what now check the dimension now it's 10 it's 15 okay one thing you have to define that means from this center to this center its dimension should be 30 okay we'll check it yeah it's 30 now it's completely turned to black that means this sketch is 
fully defined you can see the sketch without dimension here by uh, you can hide the dimension like this like this yeah here is the plate sketch sorry the plate washer sketch 2d sketch uh, so I have to remove uh, one or two items these lines from here uh, for that I am using the trim entities click on it and I'm using the power trim just hold on your left mouse button and trim it trim it trim it yeah that's it now it's our okay again I the blue comes here so we have to apply the dimension here oh no that uh, that makes it to our different yeah now it's clear it's fully defined uh, school is it's a fully defined 2d sketch of plate washer I think you could understand about how to use the a rectangle circle arc mid center arc and trim and this power trim tool etc and thank you friends I hope you could understand how to draw it and uh, feel free to share your thoughts and comments and uh, if you like my video please like it and subscribe my, cha my channel to get new videos and thank you friends bye bye